Hi, my name is Jake, and I'm looking for a place to live in New York City. Dun da da da. I'm looking to move out anytime between now and December 1st. I'm a 33 year old gay guy, and while being gay is not a big deal to me, I just want to get that out of the way because I don't want to live with a homophobe. Why? Because homophobes are stupid. Anyway, my maximum budget is $1,000 a month under ideal circumstances. I have first month's rent, last month's rent, and deposit to throw down if you need all of that up front. I'm financially stable and I pay my bills on time. My current roommate of three years can vouch for that, and so can my bank. As for why I'm moving out of my current location, my roommate needs to relocate. And to make a long story short, staying at my current place would mean a 20% price hike. Also, when I moved here three years ago, my bedroom used to face a quiet little forest until one day they built a park. Now my bedroom faces 5 trillion screaming children every day. Okay, maybe just like 15. But still, screaming children, not fun. I hope I can move to a slightly quieter spot. So who am I and what do I do? I am an agnostic Jew and I am a transplant from the West Coast who has been living in New York City for 4.5 years. I bartend four nights a week and go to school part-time. My goal is eventually to earn a bachelor's or bachelor's, oh, bachelor's degree, master's degree in molecular biology and work at a research lab finding cures to diseases, or maybe just one disease. Aside from that, I work out a lot. When I have free time, I like to produce music with my headphones on so I don't cause noise problems and produce videos like this one. I tend to sleep in because my night job keeps me up late, so I am not a morning person. I sleep in the morning. So let's talk about drugs. I don't do any of them. In fact, I don't smoke cigarettes, and I hate cigarette smoke. If you smoke weed, that's fine with me, but personally, I don't smoke weed either. And despite being a bartender, I rarely drink. As for cleaning habits, I am not a slob, but I am not a neat freak either. I keep common areas clean, and my bedroom will oscillate between pretty and hurricane, depending on whether or not there's an exam coming up. But for the most part, even my bedroom is kept decent, and I never ever leave food out because food attracts rats and cockroaches, and those are very ill. If you still find me interesting and would like to talk with me about moving into your available room, then you can email me at jakebensonmusic at gmail.com. Again, that is jakebensonmusic at gmail.com. Thank you for watching this video, and if you know anyone who has an available room, by all means, share this video with them. And while you're at it, share this video with all your other friends, family members, and cats as well. The end.